Hi everybody, welcome back. It's good to see you again. Let's spend some time together delving into the questions that you need to know, situations you need to understand, and get some downloaded, creative, and guided information through the tarot and our highest good and our highest life for you now. Enjoy your reading. And remember, I'm Priestess and Medium Roslyn. This is Love, Strength, Beauty Tarot. And I'm here for you. Emergency readings are back on, so don't be afraid. Talk to you soon. Enjoy your reading. Taurus, welcome back. This is Priestess and Medium Roslyn. I hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well and feeling good and prosperous and love, Taurus. You've made it back to Love, Strength, Beauty, Tarot. Thanks for being part of the Soul Family here. And if you're not yet, you can like, share, and subscribe. And share the videos out for someone else who might be, you know, needing some help at the time or your cross watcher. I have been, um, you know, I've been doing this for over 10 years, if you don't know me. Um, Taurus, and I enjoy giving readings and guidance to help us along. Uh, and you don't have to feel judged with me. If you want to know more about me, you can click in the description box below and find out, you know, what's going on with me and if there's any ways that we can investigate together changes that are going on in your life, Taurus. Okay, these are going to be some follow-up reads and they could cover any kind of mundane thing any general thing going on in your life right now Taurus you have to forgive me because I'm learning to shuffle these they're new I love them I love the colors I love the energy but I'm just not used to little cards Taurus. <laughs> oh okay let's get into this it should be interesting Taurus because we're closing out 2021 and 2022 it looks like it's full of manifesting for everybody it looks like everyone is going to get at least something that they want like you know something that they've been holding in their heart or maybe they can get free from something that's been you know they've been holding it in their heart and it's blocking so let's see what's going on for you Taurus. all right taurus what does taurus need to know Tell us about Taurus. What's happening with Taurus right now? The sign of Taurus. What's going on here for Taurus? What does Taurus need to know? What's happening for Taurus right now? All right, let's see. Oh, the tower. Huh. So that's definitely a card that is so clear that you need to release something spiritually towards something toxic that's been building up. Yeah. For you, Taurus, it looks like this may release something that's been blocking your money and your stability. Okay. When you have the spiritual release, even though it doesn't feel that good, it may free up some of your energy so that you'll be able to manifest and have these good things coming in. Yeah, you are about to release something. There may have been a lot of tears going on, some depression going on, uh, because what happened was something really broke your heart or tore your heart apart, made you feel like you had been betrayed, stabbed in the heart, literally, like feeling like, you know, you couldn't trust, you couldn't open up again. Nine of Swords, you may be feeling this right now, a lot of discomfort, lack of sleep anxiety feeling that you can't share and be safe with your life and with your energy um i can see that you were open before Taurus. i can see that you like to network you like to be around people you like to have you know the connections moving forward in your life but this energy here is like when we go through something that extreme that may have been a breakup, it may have been that you lost your income, it may have been that someone close to you, they just weren't there for you, it leaves us kind of in this energy of four cups, like we don't even like the hand that we were dealt, we don't like the choices that we do have to make, but you can make the choice to kind of move on and start to feel better. Yeah, Ten of Cups. Yeah, and two of wands, you're going to start over. Now, possibly, Taurus, if this is feeling like a love read for you, you know, that this is something that happened with your love, 
what's going to happen is it when you move on it's going to manifest a new you know a new love um if you're still with the same person it's going to feel different it's going to feel more safe and more secure um but a lot of you i think you're going to move on with this two of wands energy you're going to start being much more creative and you're going to be much more balanced yeah that's directly what i'm getting here for you so this being in the slumps and feeling like that it's not going to continue to last your your money is going to pick up you're manifesting your heart energy you're going to feel like it's safe to come out and love again let's see what else is here yeah so what's happening here is it feels like you're going to release something that had you in a state of competition confusion uh, something that was directly tied to your security and comfort made you feel threatened. And you're going to manifest past it. This is your card. This is the Herald font. This is the card for you, Taurus. This is confirmation that this information is for you. You're showing up in your own reading. <laughs> what else should Taurus know here? Because it looks like you're definitely going to find balance and peace moving forward. That's what it looks like. The Magician. Yeah, you're going to manifest. So you've got Two of Wands, the Hierophant, the Magician. It looks like family, love, money, security, wealth, all of that is coming together for you. Okay. So you might have felt so betrayed, so, you know, so heartbroken, so sad. And you may be releasing some of that now through the form of anxiety with this Nine of Swords crowning you. But I want you to know, Taurus, that it's going to get much better. You're going to make like a leap, not just little steps. You're going to make a huge leap into your future. It's going to be much better. Okay. Much, much better. All of this with the anxiety, the insomnia, tears, wondering about if you can trust other people is going to disappear okay and i'm wishing you the absolute best of your love your consistency in life your healing your growth i'm wishing you the absolute best taurus you can do it okay i'll talk to you soon take care bye-bye